Hello everyone, and welcome back to our Fallout New Vegas Desert Ranger survival playthrough. And as I was as I was uh, going through the medical clinic and looting it off uh, off screen, I came across a couple terminals I thought were interesting to the story. So we'll pick it up here today before continuing on. All right. So the first terminal here is appointment calendar. This is in the medical thing. Sinclair plus Miss Keys transmitted to Sierra Madre. Sinclair plus Miss Keys transmitted to Sierra Madre. Uh, Domino plus Miss Keys transmitted to Chief Physician's Terminal. Uh, let's see. Sinclair Sinclair proposed moving one auto dock to casino and scheduling visits there. Sinclair agreed. I guess that must have been the doctor talking to the Sinclair. So are they? Anyways, this is the more interesting one. This is the appointment calendar visit transferred over to this computer. Miss Key showed up sans Sinclair, escorted by Mr. Domino. He explained to me that Miss Keys had developed a throat infection and asked if the auto doc could help. I asked uh, Sierra Ma I asked about Sierra Madre's auto, auto doc. He uh, said he didn't want to alarm Sinclair. I ran some tests. Miss Keys Miss Key's voice is fine. Her loss of voice was more uh is more listless than is symptomatic of uh, excessive medics usage. When I tried to speak to her about it, Mr. Domino intervened. I warned them too much chem usage uh, could render a subject comatose. Domino laughed. I lost my temper, and he said he'd return another time when I was in better spirits. I despise that man. And then this is the next entry. Unpleasant visit. Domino stopped by to ask the, t ask the test results in Vera's voice. He seemed concerned she would lose her voice uh, for the gala event. I told her if Miss Keys was uh, concerned, she could come see me, and I would only disclose medical information to her. I told him the auto docs were more than capable of healing Miss Keys' voice if she had developed any throat infection, uh, and we could even operate if need be if she tore her larynx. Uh, he seemed satisfied by the news. I apologize, amazingly enough. Uh, left a bottle of wine as a token of his appreciation. I told him I felt it was inappropriate. He insisted. I dumped it into the trash. Well, that would explain the bottle of wine over here. Um, so yeah, I think Dean Domino was doing something with the medical, with the, uh, auto docs, and that's why Christine's voice got ripped out. I never caught that before, and just now noticed it. Alright, this is going out the back way, because I've never been there. Yeah, I was just seeing more of it. Oh. Let's get that one. Yeah, it's just, ooh, return vending, return item. Yeah, I love how these little shops and everything around here. It just, it always feels so cold. Like, I don't know, I just, for whatever reason, this location always felt, ooh, thought that was a, was a uh, means of like a radio, but it's actually a secret sesh. Hey, don't you do that. Ah. Alright, this has got to be my favorite fight yet. Uh-oh. And we're going off the roof. That was going to get interesting. Alright, let's see if I can hit the head while falling off the roof. I can't hit the... There we go. Oh my gosh, you were in there, weren't you? Yep. He was on layer two. 
That's okay. I can still flee. Oh, that's nice. It won't be too far. So it's not too hard to get out. It's at least, I gotta say, they seem to have made this area a little small, but like, I don't know. Is it environmentally dangerous? Like, I don't know. I really like this place. I just wish it was bigger and less maze like. Uh oh. Well, at least we'll get a quick reload out of it. I always gotta say I like that about uh, Vax reloads. I'll take that. Alright. Well, we made it back to the villa. I think I'm supposed to head this way. But, yeah, I thought I heard someone really close by. Nice. Yeah, headshotting these guys aren't too bad. Alright. Alright, so we got two of our three guys. What's this? Why, it's a little doll. Were you carved by a craftsman? Or mauled by a drunk who didn't know his tools? Can't believe the idiot swallowed his collar. I'm not going to hurt you. Yet. Much. Scars tell a story. Some old, some new. The one on the throat is fresh and red. That's not creepy. Alright. Probably get some healing items in here. And some water, that'll be helpful. I don't have means of very many stim packs, but I seem to have more stim packs than anything else. Alright, so the residential district is that way. Uh oh. And I missed. That's very good. Wow. There you go. Got into the residential district. Picking up signals near your location. Detonators. Watch for traps. Ooh, that's fun. Ghost Seeker. Stealing mines must be Jane Dominus. Yeah. Dirty water. Seven of hearts from the Sierra Madre. Mentats. Like a oh nice a metal box. I'll hold up the. Nice, I like it. Yeah. Uh oh. Probably grenades. Yep, that was grenades. Tried to get out of there. I think Dean Domino uh, left a bunch of traps in this area. Picking up signals near your location. Detonators, watch for traps. Starting to understand of how, uh. Okay, pressure plate. Cool. Disarm, disarm. Now let's get the. There we go, disarm the grenade bouquet. Oops, that's alright. Try to go around the cloud. Oh. Disarm the grenade, but okay, because apparently there's just a bunch of those. Oh, 
Let him create empty. Alright, so this is clearly the path we were meant to take. looks not so pleasant. Oh, that's cool. He rigged it below the table. Really hit someone's legs with that. Alright, this is like the stealthiest I've ever had to be. can jump that now that's all right at least we can avoid the cloud this way uh oh I have no idea well at least I missed all the uh, missed all the traps see him. I think I see him. Hope that tourist is hurrying and it got all day. I hear him. Yeah, it seems like he's in this building. I just need to figure out a way to get up there. That was easy. If there's anything we're stealing before I talk to him. Oh no, he's up here. Oh, it's empty the suitcases. Came all this way. Least I can do is let you rest your feet for a second. Yeah, hey, Dean Domino, he was definitely that guy that the terminal was talking to. Yeah, let's sit down there with him. Why not? The Sierra Madre. Beauty, isn't she? She the one who invited you here. Or maybe you didn't catch her voice on the radio. Woke up confused like some of the others. Least you're still breathing. By the way, don't get up or make any sudden motions, no matter how uncomfortable that chair gets. The cushion's just for show. Nice. Better be a shape chair, or you're gonna get us both killed. Why not? Sounds like you've done some blue-collar construction work in your life. Your ma must be proud. Still, get up without my permission. I'll blast your ass so far through your head, it'll turn the moon cherry pie red. So, let's keep this sweet and polite, and finish our conversation with no misunderstanding. He seems like a lovely person. I see why he got on the medical person's uh, bad side. Oh, of course you do. Now it's like we're married with these big wedding rings around our necks. So why don't you hear my proposal first before you start talking about what you need? So he's the only guy who's lived here for since the bombs went off. <sighs> Just because I work in entertainment doesn't mean I'm a moron. I heard my necktie beeping. I know what that means. I'm part of this somehow. I want out of this contract. Nope. And if you put me in it, I'm not going to be too happy. So whatever's going on here, if you're part of all this, you're taking orders from me. Mm. All right, what do you want? I'll cooperate. Good, good. Then we're in business. I may be a betting man, but I like it when the odds are in our favor. If you're here with who I think, then I'd rather have you on my side than his. And it's in the hole. 
You want to live, I want what's in the Madre. Real simple. So he genuinely has just been trying to break in for 200 years. Well, all right. Fine, meet me at the mountain. Wait, wait. Wait just a minute. I'm not walking out there on my own. I know what's out there. It's why I've planted a minefield, shotguns, and explosives all the way on the road to my little boudoir here. So we go together or we're not going at all. I'll split my hand in blackjack when the time's right. I'm not splitting up in this town. Trust me. Oh, fine. Well, if I can get That's you this, a good point. All right. Let me grab some smokes and I'll meet you at the fountain. Works, eh? Right. have to take the long way back. There's a shortcut across the way, you see. It's through the cloud, but if I'm with you, I can help you through it. Yeah, I'm going to take the long way back. All right, let's see what we can do with this level 21. All right, uh, let's get up to repair 75 just for funsies. Lockpicks at 100. Hmm. I feel like melee weapons should go up a little bit. Let's see that. Hmm. I'll put a point in explosives. Why not? If you didn't already force the lock to the gate. So we found Gene Domino, and he's oh, ghost sight. I don't know what that is. Ghost sight vision. Let's see what that does. Two ghost sights added. Oh, okay. Gives you like a little night vision effect. All right. Well, we cleaned up. We uh, we got our uh, team put back together. Oh, I see the quick way through the clouds he was talking about. I'm not gonna go that way, but still fun. Anyways, with that completed, uh, let's try to get back to the fountain. Hopefully since I killed everything and everyone coming this way, it won't be too bad. But yeah, uh, let me know what you guys uh, think about this DLC. Like, I always have such a mixed opinion on it. I don't know if I went the right way there, but close enough. Just don't want to get poisoned. Yeah, I don't know. It's just this this uh, this DLC is the only one where you don't have like free roam of a location. So you know, it does stand out. Ooh, ooh. Let's get the mine. I thought that was a. I thought that was a um, coin or something to collect. Cool, and we got out of here, so we're back to the villa. Yeah. All right, let's see what we can do. There we go. Got the leg. Seems like going for the head really is the easiest, best route to take. Thought there'd be someone here, but that's all right. Yeah, the ghost sight makes everything look kind of blurry. Ooh. All right, let's see what let's see what's next. I'm gonna save in case I say something wrong, or you know, I don't really remember this DLC that well. But let's see what's going on. Oh, that's cool. That was cool. I never saw how it works. It's a little... Good. Well done. Now for the festivities and your part in all this. The owner of the Sierra Madre, for whatever reason, keyed the grand opening to the gala event itself. It needs to be far off. 
in order for the casino doors to open. As I've discussed, one person can't do it. So get your team into position indicated on your pip boy, then trigger it properly. You're so close now, don't let me down. Otherwise, I'll have to rely on the next team. Right, how am I supposed to get, what is the gala event? A display of lights, fireworks, music in the streets. A pre-war festival to mark the casino's opening. The bomb struck first. It is of no consequence, only firing the event is. Get the three in position, then travel to your position in Salida del Sol and trigger the gala. After that, the real work begins. Well, that sounds fun. Real work? What do you mean? This is a warm-up? Perhaps you think this is a simple robbery, a cheap casino heist. No, this is a heist of the centuries. We're not plundering the Sierra Madre. We're plundering history, taking from the old world itself. It won't let its secrets go easily, not without a fight. I wouldn't expect anything less. How am I supposed to get them to the markers in my map? I've unlocked the west and east gates to Cuesta del Sol and Salida del Sol. Now that you've survived the villa, I need to get to my position. You don't need me to hold your hand anymore. I'll keep monitoring you via the transceivers through the villa. If I need to offer guidance, I will. Alright, we'll head out then. I'd suggest taking the FEV reject to his position first. Although you may need his brutality and strength elsewhere first. Nah. As easy as the villa was to navigate, the outlying areas of the villa are far more dangerous. Thicker with the ghost people, traps, and toxins. Use your team as I use you. Listen to your caller. Watch where you step. You are no use to be dead. That was really cool. All right, and with that wrapped up, uh, we will call it a day here and do the rest of, or the next part of this on the next episode. So. Um, until then, I hope you had a good day going forward. I hope you have a great day going for going forward. And uh, Vintage Train Gaming is signing off for the day. Have a good one.